It's snowing. It's April 4th. Did you know in Colorado that uh, March is the snowiest month? And we had no snow, so I think we're gonna make up for it now. Oh boy. <laughs> Doing well, how are you? I'll just, I'll have a, uh, let's see, a venti uh, dark roast, no room. That's it. Thanks. Good morning. There we go. Thanks. How are we looking in here? Oh, nice. I, I like blue tape. Yeah, I can tell. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> uh, to be honest, I was going to write just like... That's tough. Joe. Hmm. Oh, poor Beam. Uh, this is good. Oh, this looks good. Well, so explain the logic here. Uh, so this is this is Harrison's. Uh, <laughs> Joe's stuff. Oh, I didn't even see that. Uh, okay. No, it's just like generally organizing it. Like this is power stuff, cords like, we don't really use, and it's like actually, yeah, like, getting stuff down here that we need to use, but stuff here that we do use. Yeah. Is, like right on our faces, and then stuff that we also use. Okay. Um, but just kind of organizing it between. Harrison likes organizing. He's got one of those personalities. My mother I'm saying it. Though. I'm saying it's a good thing. Oh, there we go. Seth's buff corner. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. Hey, but you guys can use the weights too. You have my, you have my blessing. All right, man. I like it. Just, uh, you know, whatever. I mean, a lot of the stuff on the top could be thrown away. Ah, uh, maybe not thrown away, but just put somewhere else. So. What's up, YouTube? The day marches on. What time is it? It's like 3 o'clock. Basically yesterday's vlog upper right hand corner check it out at the very end i actually already filmed what i'm about to do answering your questions but the vlog was already nine minutes so i didn't want to make it 12 minutes or 13 minutes so anyway i cut it from yesterday i'm gonna do it again today for you guys answering your questions from last week remember we were up in the mountains and i threw down the gauntlet what is the question of the day uh, so, I put it into your court, and you guys ask great questions. So, if you could take your family anywhere on vacation for a week, where would it be? This is from Bud. Bud, great question. There's so many different answers to that. I mean, it could be, you know, Austria kind of comes to mind. But, I think, for as far as a relaxing vacation with a beach, right, I would go with Hawaii, specifically Kauai. That's my answer, Hawaii. I love that place. So, thank you, Bud. Great, great, uh, great question. All right, second question. What's the funniest thing that's ever happened to you? Damien, amazing question. And I immediately, I knew what I was gonna say. Basically, my dad, my sister, and I climbed a 14er. I believe it was Mount Chavano, probably like 10 years ago now. And we were driving down this bumpy dirt road in my dad's 1990 Chevy Celebrity Station Wagon. And all of a sudden, I'm like, I hear something. And it sounds like a tin can being dragged behind our behind our car. And I'm like, wait a minute, what's that noise? Is that did the muffler fall off? Something. It was a crazy noise. And so then I look. I was sitting in the back seat on the driver's side. I look out the window, and what's rolling down the road beside us on this dirt road? The hubcap. And I'll, just casually, I'm like, oh, there's the hubcap. So I open the door, grab the hubcap as it's rolling alongside us, bring it inside. I don't know why that's funny to me, but in the moment, it was like. 
it looked like something out of uh, the Three Stooges. I don't know, like perfectly staged. The hubcap just rolling along the road. Anyway, Damien, thank you for the question. All right, third question. Basically, La Farini, thank you as always. You could, if you could take a road trip with one person, not from your family, who would it be? That's actually a pretty tough question. Um, definitely not Harrison. I definitely would not go with him. Oh, heck no. <laughs> you say no man there. Uh, let's see. I would probably go with, you know, I'll just throw out, like, Brandon. Maybe Brandon. Brandon, you know, the, the mailman that you always see in the vlogs. I feel like Brandon and I would have a great road trip together. I don't know. We, I just feel like we, we, get, we always have great conversations. So I'm going to say Brandon. Brandon, I hope you're watching. Let's go on a road trip. This is from Garrett. Garrett, I, I know this is not going to sound lame, but... I don't have, <laughs> I don't have a hobby. That's does boring. does video production count? Does video production count? Because if that counts, that's my hobby. Listen, I used to snowboard a ton, I run a ton, but that's not like, I used to make model airplanes when I was in middle school. So is that a hobby? I would say so. No, I really don't have a great like, okay, I like, I like whiskey. Is that a hobby? But I don't, it's not like I don't collect whiskey. I'm gonna say video production. Film production, YouTube, that's my hobby. That's my passion. Sorry that's not a great answer, but uh, thank you for asking anyway, and that was kind of hard. All right, that is all for today. I'm out of here, heading home, actually going for a run, then heading home, and then uh, working tonight. So, send thanks whiskey. for, <laughs> send whiskey, says Harrison. Um, oh yeah, and on that note, I'm going to the post office to get a peel. With the broken window, got to put everything in the trunk, you know, keep it secure. Doing its job. Just doing its job. Ay, ay, ay. And for all of you joining us, the new subscribers, I see you coming on. I just appreciate it. So, question of the day. I'm actually going to borrow it from uh, La Farini. Good question of the day. If you could go on a road trip with one person that is not a family member, who would it be and why? Huh? I answered that earlier. Uh, I guess I didn't really answer, ask, well, I kind of asked, yeah, I answered why. But uh, thank you for commenting below, and come back tomorrow. We're going to keep trucking. That's it. All right. Seek beauty, work hard, love each other, and we'll see you tomorrow.